Hi everyone, welcome to Kambakwe News. In a statement, Tendai BT says Zimbabwe is at crossroads because of the weight of a stolen election, unprecedented corruption and the looting of public funds. He says this sits heavy on the shoulders of Zimbabwe who want and deserve better. BT goes on to say Zimbabwe has been pushed to the bottom of the world's attention because of things happening worldwide such as the wars in Ukraine and the Middle East. He goes on to say being recalled from parliament is the hardest thing that one can go through. He knows that MPs such as Temba Mliswa and himself try to fight for the removal and repeal of section 129 of the constitution of Zimbabwe that allows MPs to be recalled but their efforts were unsuccessful. But he says like most Zimbabweans he gets to read about the illegal recalls by Mr. Sengizu Chabango in newspapers. He says that he and his family have given to the struggle and it threatens him that he has to state publicly that he will never be part of a project to weaken the democratic struggle in Zimbabwe. In a statement he said, I have been imprisoned and tortured for the change we all seek and I have stood firm. I've never worked with ZANU-PF and I'll die before I lend my hand to the illegitimate ZANU-PF regime. He knows that he had hoped to be a member of parliament but he had reservations about the process that prevented this from happening. He says he has a daily job at law practice and that is how he fights for Zimbabweans. In a statement he said fellow Zimbabweans all these charter and actions by the illegitimate regime and its proxies are an engineered distraction from the main prize to free ourselves from this rapacious dictatorship. It has been a long and torturous road and victory is closer than the distance back to where we started. Thank you for staying tuned. Please do like and subscribe to our page.